Black Saints, Mystics, and Holy Folk, The Ancient Liturgical Church, Volume 1. Did you know Jesus grew up in Africa? The Bible reads, Out of Egypt I called my son. Did you know that Mark was African? Learn our history in the early Christian church in the 456 pages of the new book, Black Saints, Mystics, and Holy Folk. Black Saints, Mystics, and Holy Folks with more than 57,000 Black Saints, Mystics, and Holy Folks. I'm James Wesley Smith. Volume 1 covers the ancient African liturgical church. Black Saints, Mystics, and Holy Folks, Volume 2, the Mombasa Martyrs of Kenya, the Uganda Martyrs of Alif and Bakita, both of whom became saints and religious clergy, Brothers Martin de Porres, Benedict de Moore, and many, many more. And Black Saints, Mystics, and Holy Folks shall be an example of the lives we are to continue to lead in the upcoming troubles. The new book shows thousands of Black Saints martyrs of early African Christianity. Volume 2 covers Indian saints since India and Africa were once joined, as well as the Oceanic saints, such as World War II's Peter Turow. Youth Bible school teachers, Okello and Erwa. Christianity sprang from Africa, the Bible said so. Out of Egypt I call my son, Hosea 11.1, 1, Matthew 2.13-15. 2, Jesus himself nourished that spiritual soil until seven years of age. Five apostles or disciples evangelized Africa. Before Antioch, Peter, Cephas, set a church in Babylon, Egypt. Matthew, Nathaniel, Bartholomew, Levi, Jude, Thaddeus, Labaeus, Jesus' cousin, Philip, and the Ethiopian eunuch, all ministered. Mark, secretary of Peter and Paul, the Gospel of Mark, was African. St. Clement finds Ethiopians in the upper room at Pentecost. The book of Acts in the Bible puts Candace of Abyssinia's eunuch finance minister among the first Christian converts. Coptic, Ethiopian, and Orthodox church branches still point to the Holy Family's residence near Heliopolis, Old Cairo. We gleaned a thousand examples of how to live saintly lives from all the early African church branches, Latin rites, Coptic, Ethiopian, Abyssinian, and Orthodox. Included are the desert fathers and mothers, like St. Mary of Egypt, martyrs, and Benicius, miracle works from Macarius the Elder, and son, St. Anthony of the Desert, Listed theologians, Tertullian, Oregon, Cyril, and Cyprian. Also found are friends of God, such as Catherine of Alexandria, Apanu, Amun, Harris, Thecla, Catanai soldiers, St. James, the African general, St. Maurice, and Caesar's martyr, Christian Theban legion. Black Catholic Christians can now confidently answer Al Islam's query, Why do you follow alien faith tradition? African martyrs nourish the roots of our own ancient branch of the Church Oriental. Christianity is an African traditional religion. An excellent resource for Black Catholic Month, CCD, RCIA, Black Saints, Mystics, and Holy Popes, 456 pages, illuminates our ancient story. Before we begin our journey, you can order it from www.booklocker.com slash books slash 3088.htm. That's booklocker.com slash books slash 3088.htm. That's booklocker.com slash books slash 3088.htm. Or write us at stbernice at yahoo.com. That's S-T-B-E-R-N-I-C-E at yahoo.com. So let us begin the discovery of Black Saints, Mystics, and Holy Folks. In a cultural anthropologic sense, the word myth does not mean fiction. Oral and historical traditions show a different reading. Those following cultural anthropology, templates, folklore, should be able to glean the kernels of truth hidden in the ether of time. 